Oh my god. So, last week, I forgot to unmute the game for a solid five minutes. This week, I forgot to unmute my mic for a solid five minutes. Streams are going well. That's <laughs> so what I was trying to say. <clears throat> wow, that was a uh, big blunder. So, we're going to go fight Psychic Folks. Uh, there's two Psychic Folks we need to beat. One says, you need Ghastlies and Haunters. So, I was building the most obvious deck for the Ghastly Haunter uh, combo, which is Stall. Um, the problem is the Stall deck is kind of boring to watch. There was no real win con, um, which is fine. Like, the win con is they draw themselves out. Um, I was testing around with it before, and it really does just need legitimately every card the deck has in order to not draw ourselves out. Um, cards like... Cards like, if I can find them... Nightly Garbage Run, which shuffles three cards from my discard pile back to our deck. And Gamble, which I scrolled right past and didn't even see. Where are you, Gamble? I know I put you in here. Gambler, sorry. Um, where, you know, we'll be drawing a bunch of cards and not using them. And so, when, once we get our, our combo together, it's basically, like, really hard to break it. So, we have, um, you know, shuffle your hand into your deck, flip a coin, and if we're fine with either flip. If we have more than eight cards in our hand, we've gained cards in our deck by flipping a heads. And if we flip a tails, we've gained a bunch of cards in our deck, but we don't need any cards because we've already got our combo gone. Um, the thing I would want to do is pull some... Um, because we don't have any other draw effectively, we have like shuffle, but no real draw. And we don't want draw <laughs> because we'd uh, kill ourselves. Um, we also like the idea of having lass um, because our deck's all trainers, so we just we shuffle our hand back in our deck, and then, you know, we don't, again, we don't need it. That's cool. The other option is... Um, recycle, which puts one card on top, and it's the card we want. So, this deck would generally run no energies. Um, and we'd want computer search to find if we need an exact card. Um, so that's the plan... for that fight. For the psychic energies only fight, uh, I think we're going to use do the wave, and we're going to try to uh, kill him with this Mewtwo, which does damage equal to the amount of psychic energies attached to all of your opponent's Pokemon. Uh, so we have two ringers for that deck. We got the um, we got the, the Wigglytuff, and we've got that Mewtwo. Now, I don't know if I have enough Pokemon in this deck. I don't know what I put in here. Let me check. Because I took out the Electabuzz. And we have Kangaskhan, Jigglypuff. We do have... Uh, let's see here. We do have four Pokeballs, I think. Check. Pokedex, Pokemon Center, Pokemon Breeder. Bill. Yeah, there it is. We have three Pokeballs. That's fine. Uh, and we have the correct, this time, uh, Jigglypuff. So that hopefully we can dig out and get a big Wigglytuff uh, pretty soon. So, let's go and try them out. I'm going to do the Psychic one first. And then we'll adjust if, if needed. Uh, we can also, I think, just build sort of a Haunter, Gengar, and then just beat down deck, or a sleep deck would be kind of fun. Just coin flip the deck. I might actually, uh, just because it'd be, you know, more fun to watch. Switch to that one. Come on, airship land. Let's go. We've arrived in GR Island. Explore the island at your leisure. I will. Psychic Fort. Oh, sorry, Psychic Stronghold. And we're gonna 
please do the wave. Do you know what? I kind of do just want to build the Sleepy Time deck. Old Nightfall. And then we'll fight them both with the Nightfall deck. We'll just add. Um, if we have the space for it, we'll add the four Mewtwo's. So let's do that. Oh, just some notes. Once you turn before you attack, you may put the point of head. Step any Pokemon's now asleep. If Tails, your active Pokemon's now asleep. Hmm. I don't know about that one. We can still have four Mr. Mimes in the Sleepy Time deck. That's fine. But yeah, so this Haunter, other than his Pokemon power, also just straights up puts him to sleep. That's great. Like, his attack doesn't doesn't have a coin flip. It's just they're asleep now. Uh, I like the, the lick on that one. And this one has Sleeping Gas, which is why he's in here. Good, good, good. All right, all right. Alakazam does confuse Ray. Oh, I learned something. Uh, very important. Uh, you cannot evolve a dark Pokemon into a normal Pokemon. So I had this Dark Adabra in, which is a fantastic card. His Pokemon power is just a loot. You discard a card and draw a card. Fantastic. And then he just does 30 damage, straight up, as his attack. Both of those are great. Uh, but then I couldn't evolve into Alakazam, which is sort of the whole point of the stall deck. Alakazam's Pokemon power lets you move damage counters around, so you just have a Mr. Mime out, he gets hit, you move his damage counters off, uh, onto like a Chansey or something on your bench, and then you Pokemon Center once your Chansey's full. Um, and then yeah, so the deck just didn't work the first time I played it, it was hilarious. Um, but we are... Do we take out the whole... I think we take out the whole Abracadabra. Not like a Zam line. Yeah, scoop up's really good. Um, if, if I was playing the full-on no energy deck, the scoop up would be one of the ways to go. Um, so you'd have like four Pokemon centers, four scoop ups, and that's how you heal your Pokemon. Because you're not worried about energy cards or evolution cards, because it's all on Chansey. I think we're taking Chansey out of this deck. I might want some. Um, I think. Uh, do we have the correct like a tongue? We have two with the correct like a tongue. Just anything that can that can paralyze them for easy. Snorlax, do you paralyze? He can't become asleep. Okay. Oh, hmm. That's pretty good for the long distance sleep. If I had four of the long distance sleep boys. Genie Dragonair, Dark Dark Dragonite. Okay. And so. We got Gassies and Haunters. We're gonna have four sleeps. What else puts stuff to sleep? We no longer want Pokemon Centers because those are now bad. Um, we want these bills. I mean, if we want Coin Flip the deck, we use Bill's Teleporter, right? <laughs> Nightly Garbage Run we don't need anymore. Keep the switches. We want the sleeps. We want Professor Oaks. Let's do two for now. Uh, four energy removals and we'll use four gusts. Oh yeah, let's look at our, our colorless boys. Who do we, who do we only have two of? That's weird. Oh, look at that. Right, right. Never mind. It's not weird. That's correct. Um, Abra has Psy Shock though. We might actually keep Abra in. What does Psychic Beam do? No. Hm. Sniper guy on the bench. That's kind of fun. What's Dark Alakazam do? Nah. Nah, we ain't about that life. He just does. 30 and switch them, and 40 and don't apply weakness resistance. That's that's not what we want to be doing in this deck. Oh, does Gengar have some fun stuff? Once you turn for your attack, maybe one counter. Okay. Around on your opponent's Pokemon. Suck so damage to it. Okay. I don't think Gengar is our plan. Good luck, Goose. Have a good one. 
I mean, if we're playing Sleepy Time, I guess we do just do Hypno Drowsy. Mind Shock, Dark Mind Prophecy. Choose one of them, this text is 10 damage to it. Okay. Do we. I think we want about. Probably about 17, 18 energy for this deck. So we got three slots. As as thematic as uh, Drowsy Hypno is for this deck, I think just if we're fighting the Psychic Fort, the Mewtwo is Psychrash is just the correct choice. Um, we have which was 10 damage for each energy card attached to the defending Pokemon. Hmm. So this Mewtwo can hit regardless of if they have Psychic Energies on them or not. But I think we just have three. We're going to run the one that can Haymaker, I think is the correct choice. The Evolution Beam. Any Pokemon, okay. I don't think we care about that. Are we still running four Mr. Mimes? Do we need the four Mr. Mimes? I don't know if we do. But if we take him out, what do we put in? Who's, who's another good sleepy boy? Drowsy kind of is sleepy boy, but meh. And then we've got Slowpoke and Slowbro, who I don't think have any of that on them. Um, and we could, we could run four of the, let me see what our, uh, our own personal sleepy boy Snorlax is. Okay, so this boy, we only have one of, he can put himself asleep and might put the opponent asleep. And this one um, can paralyze. All right, we're gonna go thematic. We're gonna keep we're gonna keep our opponents down. We're gonna take out our four Mr. Mimes. We'll put them back in because I I just like Mr. Mime quite a bit. Um, if we decide we need him, let's also rename this deck. This is no longer Sayonara. It is Sleepy Time. It is NyQuil. You can spell NyQuil. Q U I L L? Probably. Alright. Let's go. I don't care who I fight first now. It's gonna be you! Daughter. No, wait. Are you daughter? No, you're not daughter. Generally. Victoria! I hope your deck is made with only psychic type energy cards. If it is, I'll accept your challenge and show you how strong I've become. Yes. Ha! Your deck's energy cards are all psychic type. Then let's start this show right with four prize cards. Okie dokie. And now we get to jam. Oh no. Alright. Alright, what do we got? We got Gasoline Haunter. We got a Sleep. We got a Bill. And a couple psychics. We're good to go. All we gotta do is win this coin flip. Never didn't have it. <laughs> What's this retaliate gonna do to me? It's gonna scratch me. Oh. oh, wait. Oh, you're a jerk. Hold on. Okay. So we kind of got to... Uh, Figure out how to deal with a Rattata now. So we could Pokemon Trader out our Haunter for something, and I we might need to just get rid of that Rattata, and I feel bad for it, but we'll find another Haunter, I think. We literally can't deal damage to that Rattata. Um, and it might be Lickitung? Because Lickitung can start beating right away where Snorlax takes some time to get, get going. Right, it's, it's one energy for like a time. I'm not crazy, right? Yeah, okay. We're gonna go switch out. We're just gonna win some coin flips. Every time. Let the flippening commence. Yeah, I think in the base game, Lickitung is one of the best Pokemon in that game. Um, it's got, it's a basic Pokemon. It's got, what is that, 90 HP? What'd you do? 
You energy removed me, you butthead. Uh, is that 90 HP? Uh, you can, with one energy, just paralyze somebody. If you can ever get heads. <laughs> Ignore his weakness and resistance. What a jerk. <laughs> okay, we got a couple sleeps though, so if we need to, we can keep that Kadabra. Oh, I didn't want to put that second energy there, that's fine. Is this? Hold on. Flip a coin, okay. I think I just want to keep tongue wrapping. Keep tongue wrapping me and not hitting heads. It's okay, the Rattata will die eventually. You two? Alakazam! Uh oh, this is all getting bad. Bill, get me out of this. Okay, alright. I think Gasly wants to be a hunter. If we had any energy cards, we'll figure that out later. Figure that later after we take the 10 more damage, Mr. Tata. <laughs> I'm like weirdly in the corner of this. Oh yeah, we were looking at my puppy dog last night. That's what we were doing. <clears throat> okay, Alakazam's about to come out. How bad is this for me? He can do all of his things. Spoopy, okay. Let's hope we have something cool in our prizes. There's the heads. What have I got? Psychic energy. That's not nothing. Another Kadabra. Oh no. He's shocking me with his mind. Okay. So do we switch out? I guess we don't. We're going to try everything we can to keep him from hitting us. Um, let's... I don't know if I can do multiple status effects, but we're going to try. <laughs> um, we can Pokemon Trader away this Snorlax, because we already got one. I want to get our Mewtwo. I forgot we had Pokemon Trader in this deck, and he's kind of really holding it together. <laughs> What I really want, though, is a Professor Oak. Maybe we'll go up to three. Um, we're gonna sleep. Oh, I have to flip a heads? Crap. Don't worry, I have two of them. Chat. Save me. Which me too, this. Basic entry attached to my defense by one, attached to another defense by one. Okay. Interesting. Um, we're just gonna go for a heads this time. Yes. <laughs> Alright, look at Tongue. You live to fight another day. That's actually fine. Okay. So. We can either have our Haunter... Yeah, we're gonna have our Haunter just keep him asleep as long as we can. That's the plan. Alright. Oop, I want to switch. And then he has to win a flip to wake up, and then he has to win a flip to actually hit Haunter. He didn't wake up. Alright. Alright. Step one complete. So he, yeah, have to win more than 50% of flips. Just once in the next two turns. <laughs> Which isn't the best. But um, we're going to have Mewtwo. That's three energies for Mewtwo? Or... One energy. Oh, okay. We're going to have Mewtwo absolutely annihilate this person. That's fine. Uh, we only have a gust of wind in hand. All right. Wish this deck had more card draw. I'm the one who made it. I don't know why I'm complaining like that. <laughs> Duck. Oh, 
I have to win this flip. Coin flip gods, give me a heads. Yes. <laughs> okay. I don't think. Hmm. Ten damage anywhere. Kind of want him to keep the energies on there for now. Mostly, I'm just gonna jam out. <laughs> This absolutely amazing OST. Third eye, discard any card attached to Dark Gold Duck to draw three cards. Cool. And then 50 damage for three energies. Okay. So I can energy removal next turn if they had an energy. That's fine. Um, cool. Let's just hit him. Oh, my coffee came. That was fast. Yeah, whatever. You're awake. Jeez. Yeah, we're gonna have to remove an energy here just in case he's... Or... Let me see. They've got four Psyche energies attached. One, two, three, four. Okay, that's still not enough to murder them in one turn with Dark... Or with, uh... Me too. So, yeah. Give him more turn. Another great thing about Haunter is he retreats for free! every time. Always had it. Alright. I think we might sandbag that psychic energy. Yeah, we're gonna sandbag that for now. We're just gonna... One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Okay, yeah, we're gonna hit one more time. With our special boy haunter. Finally, the tails. Now that I don't need them to, they flip one. And we both have no cards in hand. Alright. Yeah, stay asleep. The power of Haunter compels you. Okay, so Dark Adapter is going to do 30 damage to somebody next turn, unless they're Haunter. Um. Yeah, we're going to switch out. Play Mewtwo. We can Super Psy if we need to as well. This is all good. Oh, second Haunter. We've had first Haunter, yes. But what about second Haunter? Eradicate for a Dark Alakazam. <laughs> <laughs> uh, there's a Kangaskhan here. I'm only gonna deal 30 damage. Okay, so one more psychic energy, I'll deal 20 damage a turn. Hmm. Like a tango deal 10. Yeah, I'm just gonna. Or hold on. I can kill the Dark Cadabra. Right? How many energy cards do you have over there? Three? And that's 60? Yeah, I'm gonna kill that Dark Cadabra. Where's where's my gust of wind? I'd say this like, like I can't just attach the psychic energy, but I'm scurred. Oh, I could have just played the psychic energy. They got one. They've only got one prize left. Okay. So what have we learned? We've learned that. I can't believe it! I lost! You're so tough! Um... We've learned that we kind of want... 
three Professor Oaks, I think, is correct. Um, that the Pokemon traders are kind of clutch. And we might need more energy. It's been one game, so, you know, I can't exactly tell. Faux show. What do we get? We got a rocket sneak attack. Trainer cards, one of them. Okay. Dark Marowak. Got more Lickitung. Heck yeah. I might just put that like a tongue straight in this deck. Dr. Mary Booster Pack, I think we've got more chances. Oh boy. Oh, you're gonna beat me with your stupid superhuman abilities. You have to go defeat other members now. You wanna go on. Okay, cool. Um Alright, Nightbolt, let's let's see. So I think we do want more like tongues. I don't know if the Snorlax is worth it. I think I'd rather have Kangaskhan. How many Kangaskhans do we have down here? Up here. We got two available. Yeah, we'll play two, and then we'll do one more dress rope. All right. Let's administer some medication. Have you prepared a deck facilitating my requirements? Oh wait, sorry. I think I had Clyde as like the southern draw. <clears throat> Have you prepared a deck facilitating my requirements? Remember, I only dual decks with a total of six Ghastly and Haunter cards. If you have any combination of these totaling six cards, we may battle. I mean, that wasn't Southern Draw. I apologize. That was terrible. Well, shall we begin? Look at this guy. Baseball cap pulled down so I can't see his tell. Well. We're going in, boys. Just a ghastly and a prayer. And a heads. We're doing good. Alright. Never mind, he's got a Kangaskhan. My ghastly can't even damage him. We're doing bad. Just keep him paralyzed. Nope. It's all going down. I just, I just need to actually draw any of my basics. I've got plenty of basic Pokemon. Cool, we've got plenty of Pokemon traders. Okay, I'm taking the Pokemon traders out. They suck. Useless in this situation. Um, I'm gonna keep all those in my hand. This time, though, we're gonna flip ahead. Like we've always known we can. Didn't see what he evolved. Press A too fast. The Haunter, okay. Do we have any way to. Nope. Whoa. Do what you do best, Ghastly. Just keep licking him up. Alright, hear me out. We attach Psychic Energy to Ghastly. We have Professor Oak. Okay, we get some stuff to do, which is nice. We got a Kangaskhan and a Mewtwo. And then, once we finish our turn, which will be... Building up. A Lick Tongue, another Professor Oak. Good, you're good. Um, and building again to get another Psychic Energy. Excellent, okay. Alright. So we can actually just grab these energies back with energy conversion. Because this ghastly is dope. Alright. Which haunter are you? Hypnosis and Dream Eater. And he has to be asleep to be Dream Eaten, right? Okay. Alright, here's the plan. Play a contingency ghastly, he's gonna get haunted later. We are going to. Hmm. I think we're gonna make a good. like a Kangaskhan ready to attack for a bunch of damage, because that Mewtwo can get powered up with one energy card. Yeah. 
Master's voice had came down here. It's coin flip the deck. We're coin flipping. That's the whole goal. I played that guess this turn. I did okay. We're gonna energy convert again. We want all of our psychic energies back. And then I think we're just going to. Oh, we don't want to haunt around him though. What's his retreat cost? I don't even know what that guess's retreat cost is. Oh, it's just free. Heck yeah. All right. Um, we're gonna... Well, I'm gonna go. Uh... <laughs> Absolutely misclick that. Okay. We got two energy removals. Good. Kangaskhan, stay down. Stand down, Kangaskhan. We have our own Kangaskhan we're powering up. All right. Um, so what we wanted to do was retreat this, not end the turn, put this Kangaskhan out, and then we get to fetch. There we go. Second Kangaskhan on the bench. Oh no. Powered up Kangaskhan. Let's flip a bunch of heads here. One heads. One heads. One heads. Two heads? One heads. Well, 20 damage is 20 damage, I guess. That's another Haunter. Okay, good news. I think he has two of those Dream Eater Haunters. Let's check. Okay, good news about this is... Oh, I guess I can't retreat if I'm asleep. Never mind. It's like, I could just retreat for free. Derp, derp, derp. Um, gonna play a Haunter on this Ghastly. We're gonna Psychic Energy up you. All right, this time we're gonna Comet Punch for all the damage. All the damage? All the damage? Okay, well 40 damage is some of the damage. I'll take it. <laughs> Alright. Haunter's ready to go. Mewtwo's next, I guess? Yeah, I think so. Alright, let's do it. Come on, 50-50. One... Two, there we go, that's all we needed. Now we're gonna get four. Nope. We're gonna get three? Hey, just to prove I can. <laughs> oh, asleep. Good, good, good. Alright. So worst case scenario, he does 20 damage. You monster. You double monster. He's doing what we do only better. <laughs> I can one shot him though. And yeah, we're gonna switch out to our um, Mewtwo and one shot him I think is the plan. We'll play Continuously Mewtwo, I think. He's got at least like four or five energy cards attached to this shit. What? It's not, it's not resist or weakness to psychic? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. I've made a mistake. He's holding all of the sleeps. About my mistakes. I've made a few. Yeah, he's not weak to. Uh oh. Okay. Well, we're just gonna comment punch him for 80, right? For 80, right? For 60, right? Yeah, for 60, right? 
For 40, right? <laughs> okay. As long as he doesn't have another sleep, we're gonna be okay. I mean, he's gonna flip heads every day, though. We should have slept him. That would have been smart. Okay, because we can always just jam out to the sweet OST. Alright. A couple of Kangish Khans, a couple of really hurt haunters. I don't have any gusts in my hand. Alright. I think we'll make sure Mewtwo's ready to go. We'll just try to win all our flips here. Hey, 80 damage. I knew we could do it. Now we just gotta win one flip. Do we remove an energy from here? Does it matter? This Kangaskhan. This Kangaskhan can't get fully powered up. That's not good. I think we have all of our different basics out, right? We could use another counter, I guess? But I guess he's just good by himself, so... I think we'll just make this Mewtwo so we can do 50 when we want to. First step is win any one of these heads. Okay. <laughs> Let's see, here's where I flip four tails. So I'll take a single heads. There's another hunter. A drowsy. Couple of sleeps. Okay, okay, okay. I don't think Kangashan's hurting us, so we don't really need to sleep in. Take 60. So I swear that coin flip isn't random chance. It depends on when you like like the opponent's coin flip is, is random chance. Um but yours it depends on when you flip it. If you know what I mean, like what what frame of the animation it is. I think each frame is a different um is a yeah, heads or a tails, and as a kid, I would always try to flip it when I could see the full face of the coin. I think that was always a heads, um, but I might just be crazy. <laughs> I don't know if anyone else has ever experienced that. What I have experienced is these sick jams. Okay, what are we doing? I'm gonna sandbag that psychic energy. We're gonna win two of these coin flips. And we did. Alright. So if you notice, I was focused as hell on that coin flip because I'm, I still believe that that might be the case. <laughs> it probably isn't. Alright, Drowsy, what are we doing? the tails you jerk wow have they flipped it have they flipped the tails this game i don't think they have that's all right because i'm just going to murder you drowsy first we're gonna wake nope okay well first we're gonna switch pokemon then i'm gonna murder that drowsy one two okay He's played three sleeps. Uh, Drowsy is weak to Psychic? Okay, all right. Just making sure. Uh, we're gonna switch out to Mewtwo. And that Psychic Crash has gotta do it, right? He's got a billion Psychic Energy, two, four, five, six. Yeah, okay.
keep forgetting they only have four. Four prizes. Yeah. I... <clears throat> Sorry, excuse me. Y yeah, I lost. Here are your booster packs. Oh boy, a rocket booster pack. Dark Doug Trio. Good Charmander, Annoying Squirtle, excellent. And a Legends pack. What could you possibly want in there? A Moltres. Okay. But how could I lose? Boo hoo hoo. <laughs> oh, I'll turn the final switch on. Since this means the elevator is now operational, you can move on. Claire should be waiting for you at the top of the stronghold. Oh. Uh. Since you defeated three members, you may come up to the top floor. I'll be waiting for you to arrive to start our card duel. Is that what you team GR people call it? All right. Oops, I didn't mean to save, but we're gonna save anyway. And then, let's check on what Claire's conditions are. Claire's deck. It's Ronald. I've acquired some information about the GR Psychic Leader, Claire. Claire's a very wise opponent. She employs a very strange rule. Anytime a player's Pokemon is knocked out in a battle against her, the energy card is attached to her turn to that player's hand. Okay. Alright, 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 alright. Uh, that means you'll have, certainly have a lot of energy cards for this fight, but she's too clever to let you take full advantage of that. To counter this, she has plenty of energy removal and super energy removal cards instead of her deck. So should we run the energy list deck? Is that a thing we should do? Be careful of pushes Dark Gengar's push side attack, you push Pokemon back to your bench. Oh well. That could be annoying. Hmm. I'm gonna try it. Should we try it? I think we should try it. We're gonna do it, we're gonna do it. Ah. Okay, so this deck. Runs four Mr. Mimes. Um, it can run a number of Haunters, and I, I don't know if I'm going to keep them in or not, but we'll see. We're going to run Woo. the Aber with the most butt, which is you. We're going to run Alakazam. And we're going to run. So I'm kind of going to do this the same way I do the, uh, um, uh, my Rain Dance deck, is we're going to have Pokemon Breeders instead of normal evolving, because we want to get that engine online as fast as possible. Uh, we're going to run four Chanseys. I'm going to run zero energy cards. My watch says it's time for me to get moving. Get rid of these Lickitungs. I'm oh, sorry, these Kangaskhans. <clears throat> we might run some Snorlax as well. I don't think we need them though. We'll see. We'll see if we run in and we get murdered before we're able to uh, put our engine together, then we'll uh, we'll run some Snorlax too. All right. We want energy removal. We can't run super energy removal. We want gambler. Right. Let's see here. Energy retrieval, energy search. We don't want any oaks. Um, we kind of do want revives. I think we just want two though. We'll see. Actually, we'll put those in at the end if we need, if we need cards. Oh, you know what else we didn't do? Hold on. I was like, we have too many psychic Pokemon, I think. I, don't, I think we still have our uh, Muse in here. We do. We don't have a Muse. Okay, we're good. Never mind. It's four, four, three, four, one. Okay, yeah. That's 19. Uh, we don't want any sleeps. <laughs> uh, we want Gust of Winds. We might want Defenders. Sound of your vengeance. That's kind of cute, but we don't want that. Uh, we want item finders. We want probably scoop ups. We need 13 cards? Okay. So here's what we're gonna do. 
We want four Pokemon Centers. We want four Pokemon Breeders. We don't want any Bills. We're gonna run a Lass. I'm kinda tempted to run Pokeballs, but we're a nightly garbage run. We're gonna run four Recycles. We're gonna run four computer searches, and then we have a slot. <laughs> I need to find the computer searches. So to remind us, I'm just gonna put five grass energy in here. Then we're gonna call this We're gonna call this the stall deck. Let me go run. Oop! Stall! <laughs> I need to grab those um, computer searches. We're gonna grab them from Rain Dance. Oh, I want item finders too. Hmm. Okay. Sorry, Rain Dance. We're gonna put four grass energy here to remind us. <laughs> What's gonna happen is I'm not gonna remember. <laughs> And we're gonna play Rain Dance at some point, and we're gonna draw. Oops, I don't want to do that. We're gonna draw a Grass Energy and be confused. <laughs> okay. All right. So we're gonna want Computer Search. Where's our Computer Search? There it is. Okay. So my Computer Search, and we do actually want. Are we running? Sorry, I need to double check. I'm running computer search, and are we running Pokemon Traders? Okay, we're running none. We want scoop. Oh, not scoop ups though. We kind of do want scoop ups. Definitely want the switches. All right, here's the plan. We're gonna run three gusts of wind. I think we're not gonna run any energy removal. And then we're gonna run. Actually, if we don't run any injury removal, we can run four um, gust of wind. We're gonna run. That's five cards? Man. I'm forgetting exactly what we use here. And I feel like we do definitely want revives and. I didn't put any revives in, did I? That's what we did. Okay, we're gonna run some revives, and we're gonna run like get yeah, two item finders, three revives, I think. There we go. Let's try this deck out. All right. I have the perfect way to do it. Against Claire. So you've arrived then. Before we start our battle, allow me to summon the fort's special guest. He's a young. He's a young man my members happen to kidnap. He'll be here shortly. Okay. Oh man, stuck in the pattern buffer. Is it as you predicted? Has Connor? I can't say for certain. We can only get information by watching the future unfold. Well, I'm ready for our battle, Connor. Okie dokie. <laughs> I've been monitoring the way you duel with hidden cameras down below. I'm fairly certain you don't have the capacity to beat me in battle. It's a whole different experience when you battle against me. Normally, you discard a KO'd Pokemon and its energy cards. Under my rules, the discarded basic energy cards return to their hand. So, do you understand my terms? Then I suppose you'd be challenging me to a duel next. Would you like to du duel Claire? I would. Six prizes? Oh god, Claire's terrifying. <laughs> I should have given her old Granny Crane voice. All right. Here is my, this was my fear, was we were going to uh, open a hand and have, like, not the great best Pokemon to do it with. Okay. So here I think we can turn one and not do anything and then turn two Gambler, but we might just turn one Gambler. Let's find out. Well, we're gonna definitely wanna turn one Gambler. Ah! 
hear me out. We can get the Alakazam going because that Kangaskhan's not going to hurt us. And then we can Gambler. Let's try it. We can at least wait yeah, until Alakazam's up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. This is fine. We get a gas center bench. We can evolve this Abra. Shanker's trying to, try to hurt me know how. Alright, let's gamble. I don't even know if we want a heads or a tails. We got a heads. <laughs> we got a Haunter, we got a Chansey. Alright, we just need a Mr. Mime and we're good to go. Let's make a computer search for one. Alright. Discard a Ghastly and maybe a Switch. We're gonna find ourselves a Mr. Mime. We're gonna play Mr. Mime. We're gonna switch Mr. Mime to the front, and now we chillax. Um, Haunter Pokemon Center now the garbage run. We have we have nothing for Natalie Garbage Run. Alright. Now we let Claire kill herself. For all the cards you want, Claire. <laughs> She's gonna hit done a bunch of times. This isn't anywhere near as fun to play as the uh, coin flip deck, but it's very consistent. <laughs> Claire used a computer search. What'd you get, Claire? I guess we'll never know. Oh, she's she's uh powering up her Kangaskhan. Yep, yeah, we're just gonna chill. Got 30 cards left. No, oh, oh no, Slowpoke can actually do damage to me. What a jerk. And I'm weak to it. Pokemon Power, Alakazam. I hate how it's like, do I use this Pokemon Power? Default, no. Okay. Uh, I don't think we need anything else. Oh wait, we, we haven't evolved this Ghastly. I'd like to have that contingency plan in case he gets pulled out for some reason. All right, well, keep pummeling me, Claire, I guess. We can discard two Abras to computer search to find a second Chansey if we want. And then we can nightly garbage run them back into our deck. I think that's the plan. Should something happen. Um, but until then. Oh, I almost ended the turn. That would have been stupid. We'll keep, keep doing that. It's annoying now that I'm getting hit because it, the turn takes longer. <laughs> yes, I would like to use the Pokemon power. I think we will grab our second Chansey now. Um, can't really hurt to do so. Ghastly Haunter, Mr. Mime, Chansey! We're gonna Nightly or return us three cards, right? Pokemon cards, evolution cards, and our energy cards. Okay. Uh, shove those back in my deck real quick. Don't mind me. Okay. Oop. And we have a revive in case they knock out Mr. Mine. This is fine. And second Mr. Mine for good measure. I have a spot for it on the bench. I think I will, just in case. You know, you never want to... Like, if they knock this one out, I can just flip that one in. Alright. Mm -hmm. 
best OST in any Game Boy Color game. And I will fight over that. Oh no, she has Nightly Garbage one too! It's gonna take three more turns to beat her. <laughs> Pain. I could... Okay. I'm gonna try to get the AI. What's Kangaskhan's retreat cost? Let's check. Three. Okay, I'm gonna try to get the AI to um, draw more cards by Gust of Winding that Kangaskhan back out. Nope. Pokemon Power. Alakazam. Yes. I'll put on this Chansey. You know, just because. Level him out a bit. Draw extra cards. Do it, creepy old lady. Also makes my turns go by faster because I don't have to damage swap anymore. Get a lass. Do we want a lass here? I don't really think so. I mean, we have our en engine going, but she's also got seven cards in hand. We're not in danger of dying, so we'll, we'll keep the last up. Oh, sorry, she has 17 cards in hand. We definitely don't want her to last. Yes, Claire, keep thinking. Keep drawing cards. Good, good. What do we do? We've had one Alakazam, yes, but what about second Alakazam? <laughs> we have no space in our bench for it. I'll just use a switch if I have to. I don't think our opponent has anything that can one-shot Alakazam reliably, so... We've got an Alley Garbage Run that we can't use right now because there's nothing in our discard, so... Oh yes, item find for a bill. You fool. <laughs> you may have all of the cards, Claire. And she's gonna try to retreat that Gengishka now. And we can't energy removal to stop her because I don't think we put any energy removals in this deck. There we go, here's a Slowpoke. There's no reason for us to gamble right now. Um, oh, no, Alexam. Yes. So we have we have oops. we have plenty of um, Pokemon centers, so no reason to gamble. She has 21 cards in hand. Rip a Rooney. Okay. Um, I don't know why I was thinking. This is a very consistent turn base where we just move two damage counters off of Mr. Mine. Oh, though I suppose, hear me out. We could get our guests back. Um, we could put two gases in the graveyard with item finder, get our guests back, and gust. Let's do that. Just makes the turns faster. Take this Kangashan this time. Thank God you need Claire. You're just gonna draw more cards. Twenty-five in deck. All good. This deck is stupid good. Oh no! Slowpoke's back! <laughs> That's stupid boring to play. Um, 
Nope, every time. Damage swap, yes. I think we're gonna do it again. Is there a nightly garbage run in our hand? Uh, we're gonna computer search two Pokemons for a Gust of Wind. We're going to Nightly Garbage Run. Alakazam and sure, two Ghastlies. Back into our deck. And a Gust of Wind for one of these Kangashkans that's holding an energy card. So I think I can fool the AI uh, and make it last one more turn by grabbing the one with no energy because, I mean, she's got what? 16 cards in hand. So it almost definitely has an energy, but it don't matter. Ooh, a recycle. Get that gust of wind back on our deck. <laughs> We drew a gust of wind. Who would have guessed? Okay. She's learning. She's not attacking. What are you thinking about, Claire? I think I've really confused the computer here. Can we recycle again? I mean, we don't need to, right? We got 23 cards in deck. They have five. We're just going to keep ending the turn. Oh no, the slowpoke's back. Ow. <laughs> uh, Pokemon power, Alakazam, damage swap. I want the default to be yes, please. Looks like she doesn't have any Gust of Winds in her deck. Where is this Gust of Wind? There we go. I'm gonna pick the Kangashan with no energy cards on it. Give myself an extra turn. Oh, I'm gonna put this recycle. I'm gonna put that gust of wind back on my deck. If I flip ahead, then I will. Oh yeah. All right. All right, Claire, draw your last couple cards. Get it over with. Oh whoa, we drew a gust of wind. Who would have guessed? We're gonna keep this deck in our back pocket and we're only gonna use it if we feel like we need to. Claire has zero cards. Wait, she just used a computer search? Hold on. <laughs> she just used a computer search for zero cards in her deck? Excellent. A card wasn't drawn for the deck. <laughs> Heck yeah. So now, now that we know Claire is an old lady, you are good at fighting so well under my own terms. What we get? Ambition? All right. You goddamn right, Qs. <laughs> that is the cheesiest deck ever to exist. And uh, yeah, it's the one I definitely played in P99 back in the day. And uh, not sorry. <laughs> I'll admit, you're far more adept than I had assumed. Yellow Mew coin, heck yeah. So what concerns me is there's a whole nother page of coins that we haven't gotten to yet. <laughs> that's the GR Psychic coin, a prize that's required to enter the GR castle. Your next objective is to meet with King Vidisi in the GR castle. It seems that the child is... Uh, it seems that it seems the child is just as you said tough and enjoys dueling. Okay, I thought she was still talking to me, <laughs> and I was very confused. I see now why you had no worries waiting here for Connor. Then honor your promise. Ah, you're free to do as you wish, Connor. I'm Grandmaster Rod. I was waiting for you within. Wow, reading this text this big is actually actually difficult. <laughs> I was waiting for you to win your way here. It is my belief that only you hold the power to defeat Team GR. I don't think it's wrong to use Team GR's cards. However, the other's cards... However, taking the other's cards away from them is a different story. 
I'm certain you understand best after all after wow I just can't talk this morning I'm certain you understand best after all of your fights so far go find King Velisi find him and defeat him I don't mean to sound demanding but you're the only one who can do it sincerely I sincerely hope that this card will help you on your journey what do we get what do we get The only thing I remember about this card was it was actually worth a lot of money back in the day. I think just because it was rare. What do you do? There's a promo for something. I think it was like winning uh, whatever the the, po the organized play was back in the day. Once during your turn, before you attack, you may draw a card. If you do, choose a card from your hand and put it on top of your deck. This power can't be used if you to sleep, confused, or paralyzed. I much prefer um, Dark Cadabras discard and draw. And then supersonic flight, 60 damage, the coin of tails, attack does nothing. Hmm. Yeah, no, I don't think it's very good. <laughs> I'm going to return to the Pokemon Dome. Once there, we will begin preparations for the final cup. The winner of that cup earns the legendary Pokemon cards. I hope a visit once we have everything ready to go. Then we'll see for sure if you have more power than the Grand Masters. I mean, isn't this game set after the last game where I've already beaten all the Grand Masters? I'm just, you know, just saying. <laughs> I will remain here in case you should like another battle. Um, not today, Claire. All right, step one. Let's, can we save the stall deck? Do we have to view it and then save it? Uh, to the deck record machine, yes. I think I'm gonna save it over boyfriends. I haven't really gotten boyfriends to work yet. Okay, then we're gonna take, we're gonna take our computer searches out of here. And computer search. We're gonna put in these four grass energies to remind ourselves. Save and don't record to machine. We're gonna put them back in rain dance. All right. Oh, let's, let's use that deck too. Okay. Let's go see what King Velishi is all about. also check Ishahara's house. Hello? You're not Ishahara. Nope, okay. I suppose I should also check for uh, Imukami before I leave this place. Imukami? Nope, he ain't here. Alright. The elusive red Imukami. <laughs> Alright. Time to fight King Velishi. If you have the GR Colorless coin, please give it to me. No. You may not enter if you if you do not present the GR Colorless coin to me. Alright. So she's gotta put it in. Got it. Alright, so you can have it. I thought it was a trick. <laughs> this is indeed the required coin. Ding! I have placed your coin inside the door's recess. If you have the psychic coin, please give it to me. Yes. This is indeed the required coin. Ding! I have placed your psychic coin inside the door's recess. Since you have collected both coins, the doors have opened at last. Ronald? D defeated I was so thoroughly defeated. Oh, Connor, gosh, the players in here are incredibly strong. I couldn't do a thing, even after all of my work to get here. But Connor, your deck might do the trick. This is the end. Show everyone your power. If you, if you can't defeat me, though, you won't stand a chance in there. Come on, we'll play with our usual six prize rules. If you win, I'll give you a rare super energy retrieval card. All right, all right, Ronald. You know, I think Ronald just needs a friend. We got Squirtle, we got Articuno. We got no... Raw, though, okay. Who do we put out first, then? Let's put out Articuno first. It's a tough choice, we don't have any draw spells, you know? Ugh. You know what, Ronald? I should have just... Oh, there we go. We got draw spells, it's fine. <laughs> Ashley and Dratini. What are, you, what, are you, what are you playing over here? 
we are discarding two energy retrievals, so I guess I will wait a turn before I oak. Now I'm gonna oak now. Ugh. Come on, Bill. Wow. Are we sure we put our, uh, our computer switches in here? <laughs> Reader switch, item finders, okay. We're gonna... We're gonna give Ronald another turn here to beat us up. Don't you hit the heads. My god, my phone is going crazy. Alright. Wasn't important. It was just going crazy. Okay, we have two water energy, so we can at least attack with Articuno. Next turn. Then we might have to Professor Oak again. I just wish I could actually evolve my uh, my Squirtle. Maybe all of my Blastoises are in my my prizes again. <laughs> all right, we can finally. I, I am gonna play the Contingency Arcana though. Uh, I'll play Contingency Squirtle, and I think because that's two Item Finders and two Pokemon Breeders in the discard. Ugh. We're gonna Oak though. Wow, I think all of our blast toys. Nope, there's one. <laughs> and there's a computer surge. Okay. Reader, blast toys, squirtle. And then we're gonna fully power up this Articuno and we're just gonna straight up kill this guy. And hurt ourselves in the process. There's where our computer searches were. I should probably check to see what, uh... I'm confused. Ugh. Okay. I should probably check to see what, um... How many cards I got left in my deck. After all that drawing. 25? Oh, pff, pff, Plenty. We got energy retrieval. I think we can... Discard a Squirtle for that. Oh, we only have one water energy? No, oh, I thought there was two in there. Oh, no. Alright, well this time though, we're gonna hit heads. Yeah. This Articuno might be a dead boy. Oh, this Mewtwo. Okay, so I hope this Mewtwo doesn't hurt me too bad. <laughs> um, we're gonna power up our Blastoise, I think, as our backup plan. Yeah, alright. Hit him with the old. Freeze dry followed by blizzard, I think. The OST in this game is so good. Yeah, get your psychic energy back, I don't care. A war turtle? My goodness. We're just gonna hit heads though. Yeah. No need to worry about hitting our own boys. I was right, there were a bunch of Blastoise and uh, computer searches over there in my, in my uh, prizes. What I would like is a super potion. I guess it doesn't matter because you're dead. Well, Ronald, this is why you lost. Your deck sucks. Admit, Connor, you're very strong. Anyway, here's your new super energy retrieval card. Thanks, Ronald. I can't wait to not use it. <laughs> I'm sure you can beat these guys. You just gotta do your best. Anyway, fight on, Connor. See ya. What? Alright. Alright, what's going on in here? Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. Oh. What does Velishi sound like? I'm assuming he sounds like the Godfather, but I can't do a good Godfather impression. So, you have finally arrived. <laughs> no, I can't do that for too long. <laughs> I'm impressed, Connor. You have to collect the legendary cards first before I recognize you. Prove yourself by collecting those cards and putting them in your deck. I know it. 
I know you believe that you know what direction is best for Team GR. But I'll never agree with you. My ideals are immaculate. Oh, I thought he was done. Executive Clay. Ha! Oh, I missed what he said. Oh no. Executive Allison. Yes, King Lishi. Bing! Connor, you must fight my two executives first. Only with victories against both will I confront you in combat. If, that is, you can win. I'm your first opponent. Oh, sorry, that's Clay. I'm your first opponent. They call me Executive Clay. But let us not fight here. Head over to the duel table. What? I thought I was supposed to get the legendary cards. I'm confused. <laughs> now that we're here, let's start the battle. But I have special requirements for our duel that you must uphold. I have heard so much praise about the Pokemon cards of Legend. You must undoubtedly have heard about them. They are the following four cards. Voltres, Articunas, Zapdos, Dragonite. Put all four of these cards of Legend into a single deck. If you do that, I'd be more than happy to have a duel with you. Do you not have the Pokemon cards of Legend? If not, you'll have to strike some sort of deal with the Grandmasters. Well, alright, see you later. Okay, well that was a twist. I gotta go all the way back, beat up the Grandmasters, get the legendary cards back. Eh, then build a deck with them, and I'm really, I'll be honest, those cards are kind of garbage. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. VS rules are put four useless cards in your deck. Yeah, I know, but what do I take out of Rain Dance? That's the thing, is Rain Dance is so, like, on a razor's edge at all times. Well, I guess I could just, you know, if I draw them, lose, and then just try again. <clears throat> like, go down to three copies of stuff that's not computer search. Might be correct. Alright. Alright, let's... Ooh, what's this? I have mail from Ronald. Belishi's deck? How did you find out? You got your butt whipped by his, his cronies. Connor, I feel like this is the final stage, our fight against Team GR, but we've already lost. It's all up to you now. Defeat King Felici. Stop Team GR. Use your amazing cunning to utilize the full power of your cards. I beg you, Connor. Heed the boons of my final scouting mission well. I was completely overwhelmed by the Team GR executives, but because of that I couldn't gather much information about the King Felici. I do know that he has four different decks, though. Moreover, a battle against Felici is a long ordeal, to say the least. You need to beat him two times, and he switches decks before each match. He'll switch freely between his four powerful decks to stay alert. Be sure you, be sure to use your most reliable decks and play carefully. Hang in there. All right. So rain dance. Got it. Understood. Let's go. <laughs> and yes, use the heart of the cards. All right. What I was gonna do was save. I don't know what's gonna happen in here. So uh, let's see. Rod is this one. Connor, I've been expecting you. You should try your best to meet with King Glacier on GR Island. That's the only way to, to make Team GR challenge change their terrible ways. You'll put you need the Pokemon Cards of Legend to have a duel with Glacier. So let's start the final cup. Well, assuming you're prepared. Why not, Rod? Very well. Let's enter the finals hall. I've already beaten all of you. Several times. So fancy. All right, Connor, let's begin the final cup. We are the Grand Masters, the keepers of the Pokemon Cards of Legend. Without defeating all four of us, you can't earn the Cards of Legend. Let's begin. First, you'll duel Courtney. Ho ho ho, I'm your first opponent, Courtney of the Flame. Take a seat, Connor. Ho ho ho, <laughs> but don't get comfy. Let's start the six prize card duel. Right, what time is it? I do actually have an end time today, which is very soon. So we're gonna beat Courtney. Uh, I got carried away playing one of my favorite games of all time. <laughs> We're going to beat Courtney, though, and then uh, we'll pick it up tomorrow. Yeah. Oh, no, not a fire deck against a water deck. Uh, the only problem is, Kuz, is she's 100% going to have the most annoying um, Magmar out first. So the Squirtle might just be mid-speed. But I think Squirtle's correct here. Just because... Oh, and I flipped tails. Here's the annoying Magmar. No, it's Ponyta. Okay. Ponyta could two-shot me, though, which is spooky. But she'll opt not to. Okay. She's giving me a chance. <laughs> and we got a War Turtle. Never mind. Everything's coming up, Millhouse. Um, 
think we're gonna war turtle, and then we're gonna computer search for a Professor Oak if we don't draw one. But that war turtle is gonna keep us in the match. Good old one ofs, you gotta love them. It's like she knew. It's like she knew I was gonna fall this war turtle. Yeah, we're just gonna computer search. Um, we're gonna get ourselves a Professor Oak. Gonna use it. All right, what do we get? What do we get? A couple of Bill of Greeds. Some water energies. All right, I'm gonna play Bill of Greed to draw two additional cards. And Bill of Greed. Oh my goodness. And another Bill of Greed. Okay. All right, we got everything but a Blastoise. We have a computer search? I didn't even look, nope. All right, well, eat a surf. Uh-oh, it's a Rapidash, that's scary. Um, do I just start? I think I'm just gonna start powering up Articuno, just in case. All right, Corny. We got a switch, that's good. Oh wait, we already had one. If I was paying attention to what I was drawing. All right, step one, we're gonna get rid of this Moltres. Then she's gonna play her Rapidash, which is gonna be kind of spooky. Nope, she's gonna play another Moltres. Well, fine. As long as you don't dive bomb me. Like, I could Professor Oak whenever I want, but I think we're in a pretty commanding position. We already drew down to 28 cards. Yeah. I think we're doing okay. I would like a gust of wind though, actually. But we have our uh, full heal, so that's fine. The reason why is I just want to get rid of this Rapidash and this Vulpix, actually. Rapidash is a bit spoopy. Vulpix isn't that bad. Okay, Articuno is fully powered up. Just surf away. Oak, not what we wanted. So I think we will switch out here, and we're just gonna one-shot the Magmar. Well, first, we're gonna use Bill of Greed <laughs> to get ourselves a Blastoise. Never mind. We don't need to switch out here. Blastoise is love. Blastoise is life. Blastoise is a bunch of damage. the computer search you'd wanted. <laughs> Alright, so this Rapidash here is probably going to deal 30 and be... try to be unhittable next turn. Which is why I would like a Gust of Wind. Yep. So Gust of Wind would be nice. I guess I'll computer search for it if I need it. As long as it's not in my discard pile. Okay, it's not. Computer search, where are you? I'm gonna get rid of an energy retrieval and a professor oak, I think. We only need one professor oak in a hand at a time. Come here, Vulpix. Oh, we also want to full heal. Not full heal. Sorry, that's the wrong. That's the wrong thing. We want to super potion. I'm gonna get knocked out on accident. All right. All right, Rapidash, don't be unhittable again. Yes. 
using our superior coin flipping ability, we were able to actually hit him this turn. <laughs> We probably don't have enough for another battle. I've got like 12 minutes. <laughs> the next battle is against Steve. Oh no, can I not pause here? Let's see. Hey Connor, let's have a Pokemon card battle. I'll show you why they call me Thundering Steve. Well, I guess we're stuck here. Let's beat him. Let's beat him quick. This isn't quick. <laughs> oh. oh no, that's the good Voltorb too, I think, that just does 20, 20 damage straight up. Owies. I don't find a full heal, two switches. God, we're just gonna lose this, this, this Voltorb, I think. Bill of Greed gets me somewhere. Nope. Okay, so in order not to just straight up lose, I have to either draw a Pokemon or win a coin flip here. That wasn't a Pokemon. Oh, let's win a coin flip. Just like we know we can. Yes. <laughs> okay, don't play another basic Pokemon. Just please. I need to beat you quick. Damn it. Okay. Now we need to draw basic. All right. Switch, switch, full heal, Pokemon breeder, item finder. We're just gonna lose this game. <laughs> yeah. I guess I could have switched here. I wouldn't have done anything. Yeah. That's fine. We need to end anyway. We can't save in between these for some reason. I guess I could have switched to Haymaker. That probably wouldn't have been smart. We'll know that for next time. Uh, yeah, we can't do anything. Let's just let's just let him kill us. What a way to go! <laughs> and the next time we can start over from the beginning of this battle. Or can we? All right. Now that Electro Buzz is gonna murder us is the problem. Okay, alright, alright, alright. Can't freeze dry though. You know what they say, always end on a loss. <laughs> oh, we're gonna discard, we're gonna discard a switch I guess. Sure, we'll power up the Sardacuna just to die. Come on. Yep, the game knew. The game knows I have to go do some work. I mean, I'm still gonna play an Articuna on the bench and scribble on the bench, you know, just cause, but. Atom Finder. I need these water energies. We don't give up without a fight, chat, even when we have to leave. <laughs> There's the Blastoise. I feel like we get into all of our Blastoises and computer searches. Just. What happened? I should have been reading. Wait, what did he do? Oh, the Zapdos randomly uh, does damage when it enters the battlefield. Well, looks like Squirtle's weak to getting punched in the face. Okay, we might actually be able to win this one. And if we do, I'll uh, do some magic and just pause the game for a while. Okay, the problem is we still can't even attack with Articuno if we wanted to. Okay, 
Well, I shouldn't have discarded my um my item finder because I could have got more water energy that way. Buh. Always lucky. That's a Squirtle. Yeah, I suppose I could have attacked um, for 50. He would have killed himself here. Things to think about. All right, Bill, Professor of Item Finder. Um, get rid of Pokemon Breeder, get rid of a Squirtle, I'm sure. Bill, Bill, switch Item Finder, Energy Retrievals. Two energy isn't gonna be enough. I have to build for something. All right, Bill agreed. Do it. Maybe Bill agreed for energy retrieval. Hit me. Hit me with your best shot. That was his best shot. Bleh. You know what? We're gonna find a Professor Oak one way or another. <laughs> All right, and we didn't play Articuno because we we do need to leave. <laughs> but I will do everything I can anyway. Like super energy removal, the Electabuzz that's not here. Professor Oak again. Bill of Greed. I have nine cards left in the deck. Hydro Pump for... 60. Oh, that Voltorb is so good. <laughs> Oofies. Still item finder. Okay. Oop, I don't want to do this. Uh, Electabuzz is one, which will still kill me. They have super potion, though, right? Hey, there's the breeder. Had it the whole time. <laughs> It. Yes. I don't think it helps me here. One, two, three, four, five, six. It doesn't, but uh, still means I only have to do 50 damage to you. Seven cards left in the library. All right. Two. I think we can do this. Blastoise. On a Squirtle. And then we item finder away the oaks, because if we use an oak, we die. We get an energy retrieval. Cutting War Turtle. Put them all on Blastoise. Steal 50. And then kill this last Pokemon. We did it. And then we're going to pause the game from here after this. As long as this Zapdos just doesn't straight up kill me. It needs three Big Thunder. Choose a random Pokemon other than Zapdos. Type the 70 damage to that Pokemon. Don't apply weakness resistance to that attack. <gasps> oh, do not apply weakness resistance to that attack. At all? Any other effects after we use resistance? Okay. All right. That's fine because Blasters has more than 70 HP. <coughs> ah! Owies! <laughs> I can't believe I pulled that one out of my butt. Like I said, this deck sometimes razor's edge. Sometimes just wins. <laughs> oh, whatever. There we go. You're the winner. You did great. Impressive, Connor. Your next duel is with Jack. Okay. We're gonna stop it here. But thank you everybody for joining me. Uh, we'll be back tomorrow. I'm sorry to cut it off so abruptly, but I did have an end time. 
Um, and I'm streaming today because I said I would do it yesterday, but I was just so busy I couldn't I couldn't get down to to streaming anything uh, reliably. So tomorrow we'll have more time. We should be able to beat all these nerds and then uh, go over to King Vilishi and at least beat up his uh, his assistants. So until next time, thanks for watching, everybody. Please do consider um, donating to Extra Life. Uh, the streamathon for that is going to be here in exactly a month from today. Uh, it's going to be Friday the third, uh, November fourth and fifth, and uh, we're playing a whole bunch of games. So until then, have a good one, y'all. Catch you later.